video in this video I'm going to review the elite OS for Poco X2 that means Redmi K30 and if you guys are confused with the name then remember one thing Poco X2 and Redmi K30 both are same device so no problem uh, in China Redmi K30 in global or India you guys uh, uh, know about that device is Poco X2 so I think uh, there is another there is no argument here so let's get started and this is elite development and this is the last Android 11 update for uh, Poco X2 or K30 uh, so this is it and this is one kind of stable room and just Android 12 released for Poco X2 and K30 and I don't recommend to use that one and if you uh, guys are really worried about your uh, getting camera dead issue then I just uh, want to suggest you guys just shift your room just don't use the global room that means don't use the Indian rooms just use Chinese rooms based on Chinese you guys can easily use without any problem and I'm using this uh, for one year so I am I, I'm not getting any problem yet so I my suggestion will be that just change your custom room uh, change to AOSP based room or use any um, new I Chinese based room so you guys can avoid that problem and here is the all specs you guys can see and as usual we have all the necessary uh, things here and after that we have extra customizations uh, like here you guys can see network preferred network type you guys can see here so many network types are there and easily you guys can uh, access no problem and from the elite customizations we have some customizations like charging color you guys can set according to your choice and after that we have notification settings and you guys can see portrait mode you guys can set uh, some images on notification like that so here you guys can see when you just uh, swipe down the notification panel then you guys will get effect like this uh, in the background I set the image and here is the matrix effect and if you want to enable matrix effect you guys can see here here is the matrix effects just matrix effect turn the matrix effect on and you guys can easily use no problem and here you guys can see animation duration so you guys can also uh, make it change no problem and here you guys can see the text color you guys can choose the color of the text so and you guys can see it blur degree you guys can do blur degree 180 uh, 150 whatever you need you guys can do an update rate you guys can set so some customizations are there and smart network setting this is really cool and here the type settings you guys can select sim1 sim2 and dual no problem and smart mobile network if you enable this one you guys will get so many uh, features are there and this is really cool features if you want to use this is a really cool thing and after that you guys can uh, change minimize shade toggles number of toggles in expanded shade whatever you guys can do and color notification icons around the window and whatever disable global dark mode you guys can do that and PIP picture in picture mode you guys can select medium large whatever you need and double tap and here you guys can see double tap to turn off the screen and swipe up uh, swipe up whatever you need you guys can select from here so this is it this is the extra customization we had in that ROM uh, previously so this is the wallpaper and personalization just like the same as usual you guys already know about that if you are you, if you already use the EU ROM or any other ROM but this is totally based on Chinese ROM not based on EU so this is it and after that log screen as usual raise to wake and double tap everything is working without any problem and this is just cool cool I'm just loving this room I'm using for one week and more than one week I guess so and here is the color scheme and vivid saturated whatever you need you guys can select and globe mode make screen extra responsive to pressure so this is a globe mode you guys can enable like something you wiring globes then you guys can enable this one and you guys can get a great response and refresh rate 120 hertz by default working without any problem and font settings just like the same so here is the uh, display setting I missed and display settings as usual uh, setting sound and notifications as usual sound assistant and you guys know about that this is a really cool thing and you guys can set different volume 
for different applications this is the go feature i guess and you do not disturb schedule turn on and vibration sound effect additional settings just fine everything is just fine really awesome and here is the default launcher and launcher is updated launcher which is from uh new 13 and app vault latest app vault settings you guys can see dashboard privacy recommendations so so many things are there and icons you guys can make it large and small global icon animation and items everything is cool so i don't want to waste your time guys uh, just uh, going to make the video short and fingerprint face unlock everything is just uh, fine without any issue you guys can access and here is the security applications some new features cool features you guys can see you guys can easily use screen lock and shutdown lock this is cool feature shutdown lock um, it will ask your permission that means uh, your pattern lock or pin lock whatever you set it will ask before shutdown so this is working in uh, just turning on display if you turn off the display then this feature will not work so this thing should fix uh, from Xiaomi so I request them to the, do that thing and after that we have privacy battery apps and additional settings as usual the regular things are there like here you guys can see memory expansion if you have 64 GB uh, uh, then you guys will get 1 GB and if you have 128 GB then you guys will get 2 GB like mine here is the 2 GB extension memory so you guys can easily use and RAM management is just just awesome just awesome RAM management when you use you guys will f uh, not feel this is new I because this is a cool thing the, everything is just like butter smooth butter smooth butter smooth and some cool, cool some cool features everything is just cool in that room and this is really great and let me show you so here you guys can see latest wizard section you guys can easily access latest wizard widgets i'm using here so this is cool thing you guys can access without any problem and latest uh, launcher is here and you guys can see the user interface got changed and i'm using here the widgets clock widgets uh, one is digital and another is just analog and those are dynamic those are dynamic widgets working without any problem and these are dynamic like uh, 22 degree like uh, right now so this is it and this is the app vault which is totally changed and you guys can easily access from here and you guys can add widgets in the uh, app vault so no problem with that and this is a butter smooth room and double tap is working without any problem you guys can see and this is it this is the animations you guys can uh, check and let me show you some things like uh, this is the cpu throttling and no cpu thermal throttling that means your gaming performance will be awesome so no problem with that and let me show you Here is the Geekbench score. I don't believe in those uh, Geekbench scores. And which is single core is just awesome. 542 and multi core 1047, which is uh, a bit less. So I don't think about it. And let me show you another thing, and which is DRM info. And this is disappointing because this is based on uh, China ROM. So Redmi K30, you guys can see the model name. And we have the security level l3 that means if you are a otp platform user like netflix amazon prime whatever you use you guys will not be able to stream in a full hd so this is a down point and if you can sacrifice this one then this room will be your first choice this is great and very smooth and i'm using here zcam without any issue i'm using a 2g cam here and you guys can see the interface just awesome and here is another gcam working without any problem just flawless so this is it and you guys already know about the uh, panel this is the control center and new music wizards so that's it and hope you guys 
uh, understand the video and if you guys really like my videos then do subscribe and hit the bell icon and my suggestion will be just shift your rom to uh, chinese rom if you want to keep your poco x2 alive so this is it and some new features are available in that uh, latest update that means in the camera section you guys can see here blog as usual previous and we have new feature that is sticker avatars you guys can see that let me show you this is sticker avatars and you guys can see like anything if you just uh, uh, in front of the camera then you guys will be able to uh, make this this kind of things and you guys can add some avatars like this so this is it so you guys can see isn't it this is cool i guess and you guys can make stickers like this uh, really great features so this is it i hope you guys understand the video and if you guys really like my work then do subscribe and hit the bell icon so thank you for watching